All right, let's return to Libya now, where rebels fighting Gaddafi forces in the west of the country have launched a, a push on a major town not far from the capital, Tripoli. Let's speak to Al Jazeera Zena Hodor, who is in Bir Hanam, about 80 kilometers from Tripoli. Zena, what's the latest from the front line there? Well, we're actually standing at the entrance of Bir Hanem, like you mentioned, a strategic town which is now under the control of rebel fighters. The rebel fighters launched an offensive at the early hours of the morning, and just in a few hours they managed to push Gaddafi forces back. You can see behind me, um, rebels are still clearing the area. They just um, brought in a captured Gaddafi soldier. Um, it was really fierce uh, fighting since the early hours of the morning. We heard um, heavy exchange of fire, rocket fire from both sides. Now, the rebels have been trying to take over Bir Hanem for some time now, in fact, weeks. And really, the question is, how were they able to do it in just a few hours? We posed this question to a number of fighters. Some of them told us that the morale of the Qaddafi army is now quite low. Others are saying that they, uh, pr they delayed the push simply because they wanted civilians to leave the area, and that they managed to get hundreds of volunteers, not just from the Western Mountains, but but rebels from Tripoli and Zawiya to join the fight as well. Mm. So this is a major victory, a strategic town. Yes, I was going to say, so this then is a significant uh, a victory for the rebels, the capture of this town anyway, as they push towards Tripoli. They're not far from the Libyan capital, from what I understand. Uh, what, what's, what's your sentiment? What's your sense of uh, how successful they're likely to be in the coming days to get to Tripoli? Well, we have to be uh, we have to be patient and see whether or not they'll be able to push any further, and whether or not Gaddafi's forces will actually launch a counteroffensive. They've done that before. The rebels have captured towns and villages in this region, and Gaddafi forces simply come back. But it seems there is some sort of a determination. There has been a military stalemate in this area for some time now. But over recent days, we've heard the Western Military Council say the time has come to change the battle lines, and so there is a major push. They have been, there are four front lines in this area, and this is only one of them. But this, like you mentioned, is the closest to Tripoli. And they're hoping if they're, if, uh, after Bir Ghanem, there are two highways that actually reach the coast. And the most important thing, really, for them now is to reach Zawiya, which is the west of Tripoli, because they know that they can get support from inside that city, that rebels there are ready to rise up against the Qaddafi regime, but they're going to need help from outside. So this is a beginning. Yes, we've seen victories in the past here before. Um, so we can't really say whether or not they will be successful and how many days it will take but for them they're calling this a major victory. Uh, 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 Zena please tell us more about where you are Bir we, we saw uh, people milling around there behind you tell us uh, describe to us the scene where you are. Well, uh, like I mentioned, hundreds of rebels took part in the battle. Some of them have been returning from the center of the town. They've been capturing Gaddafi soldiers. They're clearing the area. There was a lot of snipers. In fact, we were in the early hours of the morning, a few kilometers from here, and there was a lot of sniper fire. So they're clearing the area. Um, the Gaddafi forces could still be inside. They could still launch a counteroffensive. So um, there, it's, a major, uh, it's a cleaning up operation for the time being. As far as we know, and this is according to rebels, six of their men were killed. They couldn't tell us how many uh, of Qaddafi's forces were killed in the uh, in the fighting early this morning, um, but um, six uh, we can confirm at least six rebel fighters were killed. All right, thank you very much, Zena Hoda, live for us from Bir Hanem in Libya as the rebels there continue their push towards the capital, Tripoli. Thank you, Zena.